Well everyone, I wanted to go and hit on one of those iPhones that basically a lot of people don't like. I would probably say that everyone hates this particular lineup of iPhone and it is kind of crazy because I do feel like in some ways, this is one of those devices that Apple made you know, quite a bit of time ago, like two years ago they debuted it. And I do think it's still a very good device. Now, the first thing I could definitely tell you is that with something like the iPhone Plus series, these are kind of the iPhones I think everyone pretty much hates. The thing with the iPhone 15 Plus and the 14 Plus is that I think the main reason why people just don't really like these particular devices pretty much comes down to our, basically our, you know, price tag of that phone. With the iPhone 15 Plus, this is an iPhone that pretty much costs essentially the same price as something like an iPhone 15 Pro. So why would somebody go ahead and buy something like an iPhone 15 Plus when you could just buy an iPhone 15 Pro basically for the exact same price tag? Now there are some cases that could be made of where an iPhone 15 Plus could be a better device and really the only reason why I think that one would be the better you know, device pretty much basically comes down to the you know, battery size and basically the size of the phone. If you want a bigger size phone, then the Plus series is probably the better one. But even with every category that we can kind of think about when it comes down to sales numbers, when it comes down to overall, you know, I guess hype about these particular devices, it doesn't really seem like too many people are happy or excited about the iPhone 15 Plus. It's been like that since the 14 Plus came out and notoriously bigger phones typically do kind of give you, I guess, a little bit of like, you know, like less people buy those bigger phones when it comes down to it. So that right there is kind of one big thing to kind of keep in mind there. But I probably would tell you that when it comes down to something like the iPhone 15 Plus, like I said, I think the main reason why people just don't really like these phones is because of the price tag being so similar to the iPhone 15 Pro. So what can Apple do to pretty much alleviate this? Well, number one, they could continue on and basically you know, still sell the older iPhone Plus models that they've already been doing. Or two, they could strategically lower the price of the iPhone 15 Plus and just a little bit more. So they could just go through, lower that price tag just a little bit more. And I guarantee you in a lot of ways, more people would end up buying something like the iPhone 15 Plus or the Plus series in general in the future. It looks like Apple is still going to be making more Plus models in the future. So that's still going to be something that's going on. So I do think in a lot of ways that could be something that could end up happening here for these types of devices. So I do think that in and of itself, once again, is another very big thing to kind of keep in mind here too. So overall, that's kind of why everyone hates those particular devices. <laughs> if you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.